Valve spring seat cutters let anyone quickly and easily machine nearly any cylinder head to properly fit your aftermarket springs. And Valve guide cutters let you shorten the guide for a high lift camshaft or narrow it to fit tighter seals. Comp offers several sizes of each to give you the exact measurements needed. Each cutter requires an arbor, which are also available in different sizes. When machining your cylinder head to fit aftermarket springs, the first thing you need to do is measure your spring seat, and if needed, the inside diameter of the valve seal. You'll need to know these sizes to order the right cutter. If you ordered your parts from Comp, the information is easy to find in the catalog. However, you may need to use a pair of calipers to measure your springs. You also need to verify that your cylinder head can be safely cut to fit the valve springs desired. On some castings, the area around the spring pocket can be thin, and cutting this area will ruin your head. Verify what you have and what you can do with it before you make any cuts. The spring seat cutter is actually very easy to use. Anyone with access to an electric drill can use it. First, you loosen the set screw and put the arbor in with the flat space aligned so that when you tighten the screw, it presses flush against it. When you are tightening this set screw, you can align the cutter up and down to help keep you from removing too much material. Then just attach the end of the arbor to your drill. Make sure everything is aligned and carefully press the drill down slowly at a low to medium speed. The pilot portion of the arbor will keep you centered on the valve guide. As you can see, even these cast iron heads are no match for the spring seat cutter. You may need to clear out the metal shavings halfway through. Be careful when cutting. You only want to remove the amount of material from the head needed for the correct fitment of the valve springs you will be using. In most cases, you can adjust the location of the cutter to stop when you have reached the bottom of the surface you are cutting. If your cylinder heads came with the valve guides pre-cut for seals, like these Pro Action small block Ford heads from RHS, you might need to cut them down to make room for triple valve springs if you're beefing up your valve train. The smaller valve seals required when using triple springs won't fit on these guides, so we have to remove material in order to make everything fit. That's where the valve guide cutter comes in. It works exactly like the spring seat cutter, except it cuts the valve guides instead of your cylinder head. As you can see, comp spring seat cutters and valve guide cutters are easy to use. Just remember these tips. Wear eye protection when drilling. Be sure of your measurements ahead of time. Verify that your cylinder heads can be safely cut to fit the valve spring desired. Use the arbor to align the cutter up and down before drilling to help keep you from removing too much material. Move the drill down slowly at a low to medium speed. Be sure to remove all metal shavings from your cylinder head when you're done drilling. Clean the head thoroughly with solvent or in a parts washer before final installation. For more information about any CompCams product, call us at 1-800-999-0853 or visit us online at compcams.com. Also, remember to like us on Facebook.